if our identity is not centered in Christ, I say that we're pretty much wasting our time. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the vlog. This is Sunday. Uh, it's gonna be a quick video because I just got everything ready before I left the hotel just to come and record this video to give you an update of what happened this week. Let me start off by telling you what Costa Rica is about. I mean, the little things that I learned. So, Costa Rica is a beautiful country. I mean, it's flora and fauna is amazing. So if you wanna see some flora and fauna, this is the only thing I got. But yeah, besides the uh, the beautiful nature, the mountains, the uh, the people, there is something very special going on here. And let me start off by telling you why. Costa Rica's population is made up of 75% of people under 25 years old. It's a really young country. I mean, when I think of this, I just think about the opportunities of the gospel coming here. This week, we talked a lot about identity. Identity was a theme, and I was just thinking about how important our identity in Christ has to be in order for us to be able to, to live a life that is um, worthy of Him. And, and what it really boils down to is when our identity is, is centered in Christ, everything else, everything else is just secondary. Everything else that's happening around us becomes secondary. Everything that um, that is hurting us, everything that is uh, not going our way, all these things become secondary. In order for us to be able to, to come into an identity with Christ, we have to go face Him. Think about this. It's like, God, I want to give you everything that I own, everything that's mine, I want to give to you. Everything that I have, every, all my feelings, all these things that I go through, I'm going to take them and I'm going to give them to you. We really have to step into his office. We have to be able to step into the office and face the ugliness of our life. If we want to be clean, if we want to find our identity in him, we have to give it all to him. We really do because it doesn't, it's no longer about you. It's no longer about what you want. It's no longer about how I feel today. It's all about what he wants for me, what he wants me to do what he's telling me to go and follow, what he's telling me to do and, and take steps of faith. It just, oh man, it just made me reflect so much because I don't, I, I, I personally don't want to step into God's office. I don't because I don't want to know what he's thinking of me. I don't want to know, uh, <laughs> I don't want to come in carrying my sin. That's really the reality. But I've been implementing that this week and in the little times that I have left, you know, um, I just try to step into his office. At least I'm knocking and just saying, God, I'm here. Every focus that we have that's distracting us from that calling is just wasting our lives. I'm not saying wasting our time. I'm, I'm saying wasting our lives. The most important thing is just, we just bow down and say, you know what, God, take control. Jesus, take the wheel. That's it. It's simple as that. And once we become our, once our identity is centered in Christ, you know, we truly become light to the world. We truly be part of the people that can change, change generation. We can truly be the people that can change something for our future. You know, when we were talking to the, ch um, not the children, when we were talking to the, to the guys, the girls uh, that came to experience God, we believe that they are the future of Costa Rica. They are the ones that have the power in their hands to be able to change a whole nation. So with that said, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Stay tuned, another video coming next week. And again, remember your identity based in Christ. All right, peace.